What is up guys, Zach Scott here playing Pokemon Scarlet. This is the Indigo Disc DLC. And next up on our list is, I think to talk to someone really quick. I just need to talk to the front desk. What's up? <laughs> Congratulations on your victory over Amaris. Now you can attempt flying time trials as many times as you like, even if you're not challenging the BB League. Would you like to attempt a flying time trial? Um, no. <laughs> Not right now. Uh, but good to know that that's a possibility. I want to move on and fight the next person. If we take a look at the map, the next person is... I thought it was going to be this this dude down here, but he's, he's the one afterwards. Um, I want to go against this right here, the um, Lacey here. She's ranked three. Got to go against her. She's a fairy type, though. So I was looking at my Pokemon to see, like, well, fairy is weak to poison weak to steel uh, but also fairy is strong against like you got to think about this is strong against fighting uh, dragon and dark so thinking about it that way um, if we take a look at my party there's some obvious things that we need to do um, Lucario is a fighter so I think I want to move him still in the party but not uh, I'll bring him out at the end when I can terrestrialize him into a full steel type and then I'll be strong against. It might be the finishing move. Who knows? O dog is fine. I, you know, there's not really. A, it's a grass fire at the moment. That's fine. Um, but fairy, like I said, is is against fighting against dark. This guy being a dragon ice, he's fine. But he has a terrestrialized move of dark. Not going to use him probably though because dragon and ice don't really go against fairy. So. In fact, dragon is is immune to fairy, and fairy, um, you know, that's not going to be great. Fairy against dragon is is really strong. So, gonna gonna want to move him out, out of the party probably. I was looking at my characters. It's time to bring T Dog back. T Dog is a steel fairy type. Has a great steel move. Has uh, the fairy type will help protect me. So I'm definitely bringing T Dog back into the fold here. Um, now, the other thing I was thinking of is, well, we still need a little more. You know, uh, this guy's fine. This guy's fine. In fact, uh, Raichu's great because he has the Iron Tail. But H Dog, I'm not so sure. You know, I'm not. I don't know. Um, none of these really stick out to me. Um, but I'll tell you what. I saw this guy here. I, I I happened to catch this this person earlier last episode. I think uh, Electros. So let's check the summary really quick. It's an electric steel type. The steel type's great. Problem is he has poison moves, but none of them are damaging poison moves. Uh, poison is strong against fairy. Um, and so if we do bring him in, I'm going to have to teach him a steel move. But might as well because he's a steel type. And um, the only... I guess there's not really... Yeah, I guess here. Check the summary. Let's just change his nickname to E-Dog and bring him in. Right? I mean, that's what that's what we're thinking, right? Could be. The problem is he's kind of a... He's, he's level 77, so he is, you know, a little deficient in levels, but T-Dog is way deficient in levels. Um, I guess I would just move him and replace H-Dog for the moment. And then we got to get these guys leveled up. And so uh, I'm probably going to just dump a bunch of uh, XP onto T-Dog for a little bit. Um, what's in my bag? I, I probably don't have that much. I think I used it all. Uh, I have some medium candy, so I can use these on T Dog. Just give them all, because T Dog's gonna—it's their time to shine. 74. See, not very great. Uh, so uh, we're gonna have to like kind of as we move on, level T Dog up a little bit. If we take a look at um, what's going on around here, we can probably just fly in right here and then make our way towards Lacey. Um, hopefully, you know, I'm just saying we got to get T-Dog leveled up before we fight. So, I don't know if there's a great way to do that. Uh, been having Pokemon battles? You tell me. Just two students in the coastal biome. I need to beat five. Could do. Would be good. Um, are there anything to buy here? Uh, let's see. What, what is there to buy? I don't really want any of this stuff. Um, yeah, it's a lot of stuff. I might need, um, how many revives do I have? Because I've been really digging into those revives a lot. Um, I have 15 left. Full heals, paralyzed heal. Um, yeah, so. Full restore. 
Let's buy some more full restores. I don't know what I'm saving it for. Just pay with cash, dude. I guess. I don't know. I need... I, I might need to go... Actually, let me, let me try something. I'm good, thanks. I want to go look at... Are there any other stores here? I simply don't know the answer to that question. Let me take a look at the map really quick. Can I go? Um, I don't know where I can go. Let's make our way towards Lacey, and then obviously we'll fight some people along the way. Lacey's right there. I gotta get T Dog up into the level, you know, 80s though. And I can always use rare candies. I'm just ho ho trying to hold on to rare candies for a little bit later. Um, oh, you know what? Hold on, let me check the boxes really quick. Um, what does Sea Dog have? Sea Dog has a. Okay, that's not good. What about this one? Okay, no. Okay, I just thought for a second maybe. Let's move on. Do I need to fight you, or have I already fought you? I've already fought you. So let's keep going. Let's go this way, and uh, as we encounter. You know, I'd be looking for more TMs, probably, if I can. This is the way. Oh, yeah, that's just a bridge. I thought that was a wall for a second. Dragon scale, baby. Oh, what did I run into? Move out of the way, little birds. I tripped on you. Your fault. Uh, let's just go ahead and uh, start off with a, with a nice hit here. There you go. That won't be much XP, but it's fine. Can't hurt. Uh, over here, whoa, I see that now. Over here, though, we have a guy who's sigh, or a girl who's sighing, wanting to fight. He just radiates coolness, is it me? Are you talking about me, girl? All right, Daria, the student. Let's go over here, let's see what we got. Uh, what are these? Gloom. How do I not know, know what Gloom is? Uh, let's see really quick. It's like a plant, flower, I don't know, poison? What do, what do, I don't even know. Uh, it's a grass poison, okay, great. I was actually right about that. So fire would work great against it. Um, or ice, if I had ice on me. Uh, ground, not so much. Psychic, yes. Um, this is a fairy. What about, does bug have any effect? No, the poison cancels that out. Steel, you know, indifferent. Let's just do a, uh, which one's which? Flash cannon, 80, 160. Let's do a uh, flat, let's do that one. And then fire is obviously going to need to happen to this gloom here. Let's go. Going to probably take him out. I can't imagine not. Oh, yeah. And, well, I could, I could imagine it. I didn't want to, though. All right. Let's do it. I don't know how much this is going to hurt, but let's see. Not bad. Sunny day. Well, you're going to get creamed again with some flames, so. Vile plume. That's a big one. In fact, it's so big, uh, I kind of want to just, you know, flash cannon, uh, armor cannon this just in case. Vino shock. I don't like that that's going to hit me. Boom! Good. Super effective as well. No complaints. And this will be, my, what, my third? And once I get five, I can talk to her, probably. Here comes Flash Cannon again. Not going to be a big deal here. We'll have to finish this thing on Toxic. Sure. Get me. Get me with it. Whatever. Do your worst. I'm badly poisoned. Oh, no. All right. Let's just uh, do another Flash Cannon. And then let's just do a Flamethrower to you. Good riddance. Super effective. Good job. All right. That wasn't bad at all. And, of course, uh, T-Dog getting the most of the XP there, which is good. 
And, uh, good. Good, 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 good. I'm part of the Elite Four. Is that the case? I don't know if I believe you. I'm part of the Elite Four, the part that shows up to challenge them, that is. Okay, that doesn't... It's not tracking with me. That doesn't make too much sense. Anyway, let's fight. You know, most of my Pokemon... I think the 80 is like the cap against these guys, so... If I can at least get, you know, T-Dog up to level 80, uh, I'll be happy. Might have to dig into some... Uh, Oh, this is good. Who's this against? Super effective against you? Great. And then we have super effective against two against you. Let's see what happens. Ouch. Good thing that wasn't effective against me. Here's Psy Shock coming at you. Nice. See ya. And then now this is what's left here. We got a Skitter Smack. Let's get her on over here and smack it. Super effective. Again, not a lot of damage, though, simply because of all that. So we also, this one's also going to be super effective against, oh, no, that's the same one. And then let's do a clear smog. Why not? Ouch. I knew that would hurt. Sure. That's not a good thing. That's a stat change thing. I mean, that's not very good. Okay, anyway, whatever. Maybe if I use that to my advantage, <laughs> it would work, but whatever. We won that one. T-Dog levels up to 75. That's what I want to see. So did O-Dog. Not to 75, but to something else. My cool self-intro was all for nothing. I know Lacey's secret. Now, this one has you know the black word bubble, which means he's probably pretty tough. I know Lacey's secret. Shall I share it with you? Yes. Tell me. Her secret. Oh, you were challenged by Satoru of the League Club. All right, all right, we'll, we'll get this done. Let's see what we got. What's, how many do you got? You got four. Uh, dang, these aren't super effective. Uh, I'll probably end up switching out this Pokemon then, because not only is it only 75, but the moves aren't that great. Um, I could do a, some electricity here. But again, E Dog isn't that high level either. Let's bring in Raichu. Swap in. We got a few super effective moves there, including the fly. And then we have a super effective Psy Shock, which I guess against this guy? I don't know. Let's do it. Let's Psy Shock him. Muddy Water. I avoided the attack. Raichu didn't, though. Goodbye, Tinta Cruel. Such a cruel hit. And then uh, liquidation. Uh, I don't like that. That's I forgot about that. Sorry, right you. My bad. Um, who else can we bring in? Someone else's super effective move, I guess. E dog, it's your time to shine, my friend. E dog coming in. Uh, Kingdra. What the heck is that? Oh, okay. Uh, well, this... Which one's better? Discharge is 80, 90. Oh, this attacks everybody? Cool. <laughs> I don't have any moves like that. That's interesting. Um... Uh, I just don't know. Um... Sure, just stick with it. Here we go. Yeah, I knew it would be something like that. Ugh. Here, hit him with the uh, the oh, hydro pump. Watch out, watch out. Yeah, water versus fire. Who knew? Who knew? All right, let's go. <laughs> All right. Let's see what I can do. Uh, oh, they're both paralyzed. That's really good, actually. That's kind of cool. Um, started to rain. Okay, am I worried about that? Not yet. T Dog has play rough, which could be interesting. Swap in. T Dog dies though. I'm gonna have to revive so he can get the XP. 
Wild Charge will target. Let's be sure to get rid of him. Play rough. Sure. Here we go. Oh, I go first. Wonderful. Awesome. That bodes well for T Dog. Nice. There you go. There you go. T Dog was damaged by the recoil. It's okay. Alo Alamomola. Let me guess. It's uh. Let's do that. Let's do uh. Play rough. Oh, wrong. Per okay, whatever. Wide guard. What is this? Oh, great. Don't guard yourself. All right, let's just see how this works out. Yeah, that did terrible. But the attack fell, which is good. Here comes wild charge, which will also hurt me a little bit. All right. All right. Is that the rain doing that? No, leftovers. Uh, let's just keep up the wild charge and the play rough. All right. There you go. That was great. My two newbies on the team. Well, actually, T Dog's a classic, an OG. Leveled up. Good. Jeez, cool your jets. I tell, I'll tell you, all right? Now tell me. What is it? Tell me. You owe it to me. Okay, you've earned it. I'll tell you Lacey's secret. Apparently, Lacey sometimes takes naps using one of her Pokemon's soft tummy as a pillow. Did you know that? What the heck? <laughs> Sneak up behind me? Cottony. Uh, I don't know what to use. That's good enough. Was that a hint? Like, I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea. All right, well, well, well. Let me go up here. I've arrived at my destination, the Coastal Plaza. Talk to me for your elite trial, I will. I wanna heal everybody first, though. And I also maybe wanna fight someone else because I'm not quite there where I wanna be level-wise. In fact, uh, hold on, what's going on over here? Light screen. Yeah, I really don't know. Um, so wait, there are machines here. Uh, over, under, around we go. Over and under, over and under. Galar Galarica twigs go all around and it's a nice accessory is what we've... What? I, I can weave you a Galarica cuff or Galarica wreath by bringing me some twigs. Okay, maybe another time. I don't think I have any. Okay, well, sure. Okay, so question. Vending machine. What, what do these have? These are just Pokeballs. Let's see what they have here. Yeah, water, Pokeballs. All these picks. Hmm. Okay, now is it the same over here? And if it is, why? <laughs> why is it the same over here? Why? I don't get it. All right. Um, let's take a look around at more trainer opportunities before we, you know, start fighting or whatever. Because I mean, I really feel like I need to be a little bit stronger for this. And in fact, uh, hold on, I should probably switch. Uh, Lucario is still in there. Just, you know, to come out later. But I should probably switch. T I should have T-Dog and E-Dog just out there immediately. Oh, yeah, and I forgot all about teaching E-Dog a steel move. Thankfully, I thought about it now. So let's look at my E-Dog here. Do I oh, I don't even know if I have a steel move. Oh, boy. Uh, move? No, not move. Uh, change moves. Um, 
gastro acid coil. I guess I'd rather forget gastro acid. I didn't even check. Uh, do I have one to replace it? All right, hold on. Change moves. Remember moves. What do we have? Okay, this is kind of cool. I don't have anything. I have acid, regular acid. But it's only 40. Gaster acid doesn't do damage. Zap cannon is... Nine. Okay, so... Shoot. Oh, yeah. Use TMs to learn a move. Oh, man. Do we have any steel moves? That's normal. What color is steel? Like a... Oh, that's good. Flash cannons. And I have two of them. That's a dark. Great. Okay. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Now we're in, now we're in this. And then I also kind of want to move him to the top two positions. I wish I had more candies. I, I mean, I have candy. I wish I had more like the, the small, medium, large type of candies. I guess I would get those from... Uh, doing the raids, I guess. Let's see. Oh, there's a twig. What does this wreath do? And how many of, of the twigs do I need? Scald, boiling water. The water move. Hey, you. Oh, so I am getting a lot of twigs. That's cool. Slowpoke. Hello. I just love Slowpoke. How about you? Is that who you're using to fight with? We'll find out. All right. Wow, look at those guys. Let's see if I'm equipped to fight these. Uh, so Slow King, Slow Bro, what are they? Let's see. Slow King is a Pokemon of, okay, that one, the Galarian one is a Poison Psychic. So Poison Psychic being weak to ground, but not bug, ghost and dark. All right, <laughs> slow bro, hold on, let's see. So I need dark or something or ground, ground or dark. I don't have H dog on my party anymore. Uh, let me see about slow bro here. This isn't great situation, but slow bro is. Oh my gosh, this one is a Galarian as well. This one's a point. They're both poison psychic. So yeah, we're gonna need uh, ground. Uh, Ghost and Dark. Well, okay. I don't know if I have any Pokemon that can... Ground, Ghost, and Dark. Yeah, none of these. <laughs> none of these. <laughs> uh, all right. But let me think about this. I'm a fairy. I'm a fairy steel electric. Uh, those are not. Sorry, poison is good against fairy. That's bad. I need to get T Dog out of here. So okay, I'm just gonna bring in Lucario, I guess. And then whatever, man. Let's just discharge everybody. Can you do it while he's gone? <laughs> All right. Oh, well. We'll see. Yeah. Sorry, Lucario. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> My bad. They weren't paralyzed at all? Are you joking? Kidding me? Alright, this is terrible. I need to get rid of E-Dog. E-Dog isn't doing... What? Oh my goodness. Um, O-Dog. And... Uh, 
a dog, sure. Swap in. I don't. I don't know what's happening here. All right. This is a this is a fight I wasn't prepared for in any means, because I just don't have types to match up against them. All right, flamethrower. That's not going to bother me too much because we're both fire. Eerie spells a little crazy, but sure. All right, we're going to just target one guy at a time. See where this gets us. That's great. We'll beat him with pure strength. Here we go. Watch out for my armor cannon. Is this all or is this... There we go. Both of them are gone. Does she have any backups? Great. We beat her. Good. Don't cry slow. No. All right. That was cool. These twigs, though. How many twigs did she need to make this kind of stuff? I can go out in the ocean, I guess. It's kind of a wall over there. Uh, I should go back and heal. Let me take a peek around the corner, though. Is there a trainer just kind of hanging out around here? There is not. Excuse me. Oh, sludge. What's that sludge stuff I just got? Hold up. That could be a cool move. Galerica twigs. I need to find out how many twigs this girl needs. All right. Uh, first up, first order of business is to heal. I like to heal my Pokemon, and then I want to see about these twigs. Tinkaton and your other Pokemon are all better now. Oh, yeah. How many twigs? All right. A uh, wreath, please. 15 twigs. Oh, yes. Do I have them? I don't have enough. Okay, well, you know, I, I tried. I don't know what that is worth, but it seems like it could be worth something. I just love Alola. Do you love me? I've become uh, absolutely obsessed with Alola region since I came to the school. Well, let's fight. Why not? See ya, the student. Whoa, look at that. Okay. Okay, wow. Uh, what, do we, what do we got here? What do we got here? Doug Trio and Executor. Play Rough is going to be super effective against Executor. And then this Flash Cannon is simply effective, but not very effective. I might need to just not use uh, against Doug Trio. I need to probably sw switch out E Dog really quick for maybe. Uh, Oh, dog. Swap that in. There you go. Let's do it. E-Dog will still benefit, of course, from this fight. Oh, dog. Breaks the mold. Yikes. Hit him and play rough. Okay. That was good, but not the greatest. Ugh. Light screen. Uh, here, I'm just going to reach into my bag, give you a hyper potion, I think. Because I don't, I don't want T-Dog to faint here. Let's do it. No, not you. Ah. 
Oh, come on. He's still in the biz? All right, fine. You're going to attack. Okay. That's not bad. Um, one more time with play rough. Going up against you. And then one more time reaching into my bag with a for a hyper potion. Using it on T-Dog. Just so T-Dog can stay in the game. Stay alive. Get the XP. We might just have to start using rare candies on T-Dog and also E-Dog. Uh, killing me. Killing you. All right. Sand Slash. Oh, wow. Um, I think we switch out T-Dog then. And we bring in someone with something super effective. Maybe, uh, uh, yeah, maybe Lucario can can jump in here with a fighting move. Meanwhile, my Ivy Cudgel against Doug Trio. This is gonna work. Uh, boom. Goodbye, super. Finally got to use that. That's great. No more of your Earth attacks. And then uh, drill run, super effective against me, but I can't let it bother me. Or a sphere. Low kick. Actually, let's stick to Ivy Cudgel here. Whoa, 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 whoa. boom! There we go. Critical hit. All right, done with that one. T-Dog is 77. You may have beat me in battle, but you can't beat me when it comes to my love of Alola. You can have your love. What is it good for? No. Anyway, let's. Uh, I'm going to keep looking around for fights and for uh, those twigs. Double battles. This guy looks a little tough. Let's see about it. If you're gonna have a double battle, then you're gonna have you gotta have strategy. Watch and learn. I don't really have strategy. <laughs> I, I don't have any double strategy. You know what I'm saying? All right, let's go. All right. I fought both of these before, so I should know. It should tell me automatically. Uh, super effective. Play rough is super effective against Flygon, and these are just okay. To the point where I'm just like, well, let me just swap him out then and bring in something a little more effective. Like, oh, dog has Ivy Cudgel. Swap in. Of course, I I don't know which one it's weak to. Whatever. It's the problem with the, the doubles, you know. Let's hit him a play rough. Oh no, Earthquake's bad. Yep. See, that's. Uh, I hate Earthquake. Super effective against T-Dog here. That's not good enough to take out Flygon because I'm only level 70 something. Oh boy. Um, okay, we're probably gonna have to, s let's see. In my bag, there should be some max potion for me. And then I'm gonna need to use Ivy Cudgel on Rabska. Hit him. I think my speed is pretty good. Good. Excellent. Does he have any extras or is that it? Yeah, Earthquake again is going to ruin me. Ah. Torkoal. All right. Um, play rough. Super effective against Flygon. Hope it lands. This one, you know, we don't really have anything. So I'm going to swap out Pokemon again. Probably bring out ooh, Lucario with the Ice Punch against Torkoal would be pretty cool. Now, if the, here's the thing: if the timing's a little off, then it won't work. I I forgot to think about that. T Dog might get destroyed by. Okay, yeah, Heat Wave is not. Okay, T Dog avoid the attack. That's good, actually. Super effective against him. Good fly guns gone and then get ready for a, a really cool move against Torkoal 
An ice move, by the way. Earthquake is going to ruin uh, T Dog. There you go. Um, if I could just get this attack off, let's let's do it. Bring out uh, E Dog. I don't care, dude. E Dog. Oh, the steel. Oh, the steel. Oh, we have another one. Oh, I forgot about that. Oh, geez. Totally forgot about that. Okay. Yeah, the steel weakness against Torkoal. Uh, wild charge against Alamola, and then if I can, please. Oh, what? Nothing's very effective. So, let's swap Pokemon then. Swap out Pokemon. Holy cow. Uh, to write you. Swap in. If I can have him fly away, that'll be ideal. Here we go. Let's do it. Come on. Chilling water. Oof. So chilling. That was good. Torkoal is going to be a real... Oh, yeah, the Earthquake is going to be bad, but it doesn't affect E-Dog. Raichu. Bad move against Raichu. If I could fly out of here with Raichu, that would be probably ideal. Let's do another wild charge. And then... Uh, I'm going to fly out of here. I don't want to get hit by the earthquake stuff. Ah, chilling water. Thankfully, Raichu avoided the attack. Goodbye. All I'm basically looking at this as is I need to level these guys up. Nice. Oh, they still have light screen. Um, just hit him with it. Why not? Dude, that was so weak. That wasn't bad. Let's do a uh, burning jealousy. Yikes. Oof. We're so jealous. Let's do a thunder punch. Maybe we can paralyze him. I don't know. That's terrible. That was great. Okay, that, that was a tough fight. Unfortunately, uh, T-Dog didn't get a lot of benefits from most of that. But we won. It hurts twice as much to lose a double battle. All right, I have been having Pokemon battles. What would she say? Eight students. Great job. And I think I just get some BP. Any extra thing? And here's a little bonus from me. Petal Blizzard. Nice. Is okay, so there more wins? How many more wins do I need? How many are we talking here? Are we talking 10? Yeah, 10. It's feasible. I simply adore bird Pokemon. Ever since I entered the school, I've dedicated myself wholeheartedly to training bird Pokemon. All right. <laughs> Annie the student. Let's see what you got, Annie. You got some birds on you. Talon Flame and two cannon. Let's do this. What do we see? What do we got? Those are the only two she has. Uh, this stuff isn't very effective, though, so let me kind of switch to something a little, uh, maybe super, oh, yeah, super, there we go. Yeah, 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 ice, let's do ice punch here, I guess. And then, here, let's battle, and let's do, let's just do a wild charge against one of these guys. How about you? Because you're not the fire one. <laughs> Luke Harvey, yo, but wait, fire, wait. Ice versus fire is not good. So that's, I don't know what, wow. And, and also steel versus fire is not good. So FYI. <laughs> I always forget these things. Yeah, whatever. Whatever. Lucario bit the dust instantly. Let's hit him with this. Let's go. Boom. Good hit. There's more where that came from. And uh, let's see. Let's bring out, I can't see anything. Let's bring out this one. 
we'll do Thunder Punch. Or whatever. Let's go! Thunder Punch. Here we go. Yeah, wow, that was big. Alright. That wasn't that, that big, but... Oh, that, oh that, yeah, I get you, I get you. Damage by the recoil. Now we just finish him off. There you go. Goodbye, Talon Flame. Awesome. Alright, we got a level up on uh, T-Dog again. No, Chirpy Peeper! <laughs> Alright. Alright, I think since T-Dog just leveled up... Now might be a good time to just dip into these rare candies. I have 25. So use it on T-Dog. I want to give him at least six. Maybe eight. 86. There you go. I'll give some to E-Dog soon as well. Oh, we actually have. Uh, oh, great. We now have these. I didn't see these. There you go. Level 80. And then let's, uh, well, let's give him both of these really quick. Uh, let's give him this final one here. He might be 81, but oh, almost 81. We'll give him to 81, then we'll give him some rare candies. Just to kind of top him off. Uh, so let's go find someone else to fight. The good old ocean. Are we going to fight? Uh, get me up here. I think we're going to fight. Are we? Talk to me. Oh, no, we're not. Okay. <laughs> I thought there's a lot of people here. I thought you were going to fight me. All right. What about you? Nope. Dang. Oh, this one surely is a fighter. Right? An indoor sea. Let's go. This crab's coming up to me like, you want to fight me? There's a sea here inside the terrarium's dome. Is it the same as the sea out is it outside, though? Probably not. Probably not. Think about it. <laughs> You're challenged by Max, the student. Okay. Don't remember what these are. Um. I guess I would just switch Pokemon until we have... I guess we're talking about electricity here, so swap in. I guess I'll hit, uh, then, I, you know what? I'll use my discharge against these two. Here we go, this will be interesting. Here we go. I don't like these dances. Ooh, we dog didn't like him either. Stop, stop dancing, please. Okay, I get it. Discharge, what, another one? What the heck? What? I hate that. Stop dancing. What is that all about? All right, how about Lucario come in here, I guess? What was that? All right. Thunder Punch. Hit one of them quick. Lucario, in your bag. We're going to use a revive because I really just need uh, him to get some XP. A little bit more XP. Thunder Punch. Good riddance. All right. There we go. And uh, e Dog did level up. Man, I hate these dances. Thunder Punch you as well, and then Ice Punch you in case I get to two punches. Goodbye. All right, now this is 10 trainers defeated. Let's go check in. There we go. Good stuff, good stuff. Uh, your strength is as vast and immeasurable as the sea itself. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right, that's 10. Let's see what my reward is. Uh, it better be a good reward. Some more BP, 200. Any other things? Little bonus uh, sludge wave. These are like poison stuff, right? 
Don't like to dip into my rare candies, but... There you go. Five for you. Now they're elite, all at least 86. All right, checking in to the elite trial. I have enough BP, of course, unless it's the price has gone up. Welcome to the Coastal Plaza, where the team that supports Miss Lacey of the Elite Four and your Z-Dog, right? One of the BB League challengers? You'll need to hand over 50 BP. Are you ready and willing to pay? Yes, let's go. Let's go. Thank you very much, duly received and noted. We need you over here, Miss Lacey. Coming. Hello again. It's just not right. Oh, if it isn't Z-Dog, I'm so glad you decided to pay me a visit. Please follow me. I'll show you the trial site. Yeah, we always got to go somewhere else for the trial, which is interesting. All right, nice site, nice scenery, nature, etc. Thank you for coming to the Coastal Plaza to challenge me. And I'm really sorry for the way I protested you joining the BB League, Z-Dog. Of course, it's true that this is quite irregular under the bylaws of our school clubs, but mainly I didn't want you to get dragged into the drama that's been troubling the club lately. I suppose our trial has already officially begun, though, so let's get to it and have some fun. The trial that I came up with is a Pokemon quiz. <laughs> oh, no. I'll ask you five questions about Pokemon. If you can answer all of them correctly, then you pass. Oh, great. Are you joking, kidding me? Are you ready to attempt my Pokemon quiz, Z-Dog? Yeah, sure. It's just a quiz. Great, then I'll just get everything ready. Oh, what kind of, how does this work? Elite trial. That's Pikachu. <laughs> Question one. All right, here we go. And look, it's everyone's favorite Pokemon, Pikachu, here to help. And with that, question one. Pikachu is an electric type Pokemon, well known for producing electricity within its body. True. But, oh, but in which part of its body does it store the electricity it generates? Uh, I don't know. Go right for the body part you think is correct. Uh, the tail? Can't can't get behind it though. Oh wait, no, it's the cheeks. Oh, the cheeks is an option. Actually, it zoomed into the cheeks. Eyes, not the eyes. Oh, the, but the tail. Ah, oh, dude, I don't know. Is it the cheeks? Am I misremembering the cheeks? Ah, oh, it's. I thought it was the tail coming in, but looking at it, I'm now thinking it's the cheeks. And that's the first thing it went to when I mouse over. Not a mouse, but you know. Uh, yes. <coughs> Excuse me. Ding, ding, ding! You got. It. I can't believe it's a cheeks. Pikachu stores its electricity in the electric sacs in its cheeks. If you poke the sacs, you'll get a little shock. But don't you think they're just super round and cute? Actually, I had remembered something about the cheeks. I don't know what it was from. Now then, I think we're ready to move on to our next quiz question. All right, take a look at Venonaut here. It's bigger than you think it would be, isn't it? But it's also fluffy and squeezable and terribly adorable, really. And so here's with question two. Even on the darkest of night, Venonaut is able to use a certain part of its body like a radar, which allows it to detect surrounding objects. Which part is, acts like a radar? Like a radar? Mouth? No. Dude, I don't know. These look like radar dishes. I'm just going to go with eyes. Okay, great. <laughs> ding, ding, ding. That's right. It's Venonaut's big eyes that serve as a radar. Isn't Venonaut even more adorable when you think about how it sees the whole world we can't see? Now then. Okay, next. Wow, how did I get that right? All right. Great. Getting weary of the quiz, how about a cup of tea? Or maybe these three Sinus Tea siblings? Okay. Here's question three. Sinus Tea like to live in precious antique teacups. But there are lots of phonies out there. It's hard to tell which cups are genuine antiques. One of these three Sinus is an antique form Sinus Tea, meaning it's a real antique cup. So which Sinus Tea has the real deal? Uh. Okay, that one has a logo on the bottom. If, if more of them spin, maybe I'll see if there's a logo on the other ones. Come on, spin. 
No logo on that one. It's got to be the logo that determines it, right? Yeah, there's a logo on that one. The right one hasn't spun. No logo. It's the middle one. There you go. Spot the difference. There you go. That one was good. Okay. Ding, ding, ding. You spotted it. That's right. An antique form synesty can be recognized by the mark on the bottom of its cup. But it doesn't matter whether they're antique form or phony form. They're also darn cute. I only like the antiques. Now then, I think we're ready to move on to our next quiz question. All right, question four. This is the Meteor Pokemon Miniature. It comes in all kinds of different colors, you know? I'll first ask you to take a good look at this pinkish Miniature for me, okay? Okay. Uh, yes. It's got swirly eyes. It's got five spikes. It's got five darker pink triangle dots. Okay. Oh, great. All right, guys, mix yourselves up real good. Okay, it's the top one. Okay, I'm keeping track. It's the right one, okay. If I have to identify it, it's the right one. Yeah, it's that one, I kept good track. Yes, okay. These are not getting harder, they're getting easier. <laughs> Ding, 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 you did it. Even after they returned to their meteor form, you still managed to find the right one. Aren't many are adorable? Their coloration varies based on what they eat. Now then, I think we're ready to move on to the very last question. This isn't hard. I mean, it was at first, oh gosh. Hey, look, here comes Granbull. Maybe it heard the word pink and decided to stop by. This little sweetie is one of my own Pokemon. It's always with me. Our last question, question five, involved Granbull here. Granbull is a quiet, delicate, and lovable Pokemon, of course, but can you tell me this? When I take a nap with my adorable Granbull, which part of, the, oh, which part of its body do I use as a pillow? Dude, I did stomach, right? That's what they said. Or wait, did he say that? Or am I just imagining that? I feel like he said it. Is that, I mean, it has to be the belly. I mean, that's what I'm thinking. Like, if I'm gonna lay on a dog, I'm gonna lay on its stomach. Okay, great. He may have said that. <laughs> that was his secret, right? Ding, 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 that's exactly right. I use that soft, adorable tummy. When I cuddle up to it, it's so soft and cozy, we both fall asleep in just seconds. And that's the end of my quiz. You managed to get all five of my questions right, which means congratulations, Z-Dog. You have officially cleared my elite trial. Man, I'm glad I didn't fail any of those. I got really lucky, though. I would have ha hated to have to redo that, but I mean, I guess it wouldn't have been too bad if it's just guessing again. Why don't we head back to the plaza? All right, let's go. Here we are. Time to confront you. Since you passed my elite trial, you've earned the right to challenge me to a battle. But what do you want to do now? Ready to move straight to it? Yes. I think. Got it. No time to waste then, right? Let's get to our positions. All right. Okay, this should be about far enough. Let me properly introduce myself for this. I'm Lacey of the Elite Four. I really didn't expect to get a challenge from someone like you, Z-Dog. Rightfully, you do belong to a different school. Honestly, I'm still a bit shocked, but I won't let my personal feelings get in the way of our battle. So, uh, let's see. First of all, I should tell you I mostly use fairy-type Pokemon. They're just nothing like an adorable pink fairy, right? They're weak to poisonous steel. Anything too caustic or cutting just doesn't suit them. Oh, but you must know this already, right, Z-Dog? Now, for this battle, I'm, going to hold, I'm not going to hold anything back. I want to be sure you walk away with a proper understanding after all. You're about to learn that cuteness is real strength. <laughs> all right. Oh, she is cute. Dang. Her cuteness is my weakness. Let's go. All right. Those are cute. Um, all right. So, steel moves, right? This time I'll be facing as my usual party as a member of the Elite Four. All right. All right. Good. Oh, but E-Dog's attack fell. That's not great. Um, so, okay. Grand, Grand Bull. Let me, let me double check this. Grand Bull is what? Double check. Make sure he is a, he's a fairy. He's just straight up fairy. So getting hit with a steel move is going to be really good for me. Hopefully, he just goes right down. Um, Whimsicott is what? 
almost looks, is a grass fairy. So we could also use uh, this flash cannon that I learned. Let's see what we got here. A little bit worried about some of this stuff, but I don't like fire punch. Oh, that was super effective against me. I gotta, here you go. Goodbye, goodbye, we planned for this. It's a rock solid strategy to go after weaknesses, which is why I'll be turning it right back on you. What, what does that mean? Don't do that to me. Flash cannon, let's see how this goes. That was good, but not as good. Slow bros coming out. We've already fought against some slow bros. This one's a different type though. Uh, so slow bro, this regular one is a water psychic. So with water, okay, well that's fine. Uh, let's see if I could do, I can't do this again, can I? No. I can do a flash cannon, probably against Whimsicott, and then, here we go, I don't know. All right, that's not terrible, I guess. All right, Whimsicott's gone. I might wanna heal these guys. Flamethrower is gonna ruin uh, T-Dog, unfortunately. We're not quite ready for Lucario yet. Um, yeah, that wasn't very good. In fact, um, so water, so we do not want to bring out a fire type. I do have a iron tail move with Raichu, so might just want to swap it in. We might want to do a revive uh, Prim Prima Arena. What the heck? What the heck is that? Prima Arena is a water fairy. These are both water fairies. I didn't know they were going to have so many water fairies. Oh, hold on. Water is weak to... Oh, electricity, but... Yeah, okay. Right? Thunder Punch. Slow bro here. And then let's uh, do... Discharge on all, all of them. Moon Blast is not great, though. Oh, come on. That's annoying. Here we go, Thunder Punch. What? What happened? Why wasn't that amazing? I'm so confused. Why wasn't that just great? Man, these are both. Ugh, these are, I should, I should have, can I have him like hold a different item? I forgot, I didn't even know they were gonna be waters. Ugh, this is steel though. Man, this sucks. Uh, I, you know what, I'm just gonna bring him out. We'll do what we gotta do. I, I'm gonna just use him and I'm gonna use a revive. Uh, I think for, for, in my bag, I'm gonna do a revive. Actually, why? All right, let me, let me, uh, in my bag, I'm just using you basically to revive, uh, maybe this one? Oh boy. This wasn't great. I don't know what's happening here. Moonblast, God, what is Moonblast? Yeah, of course, this is going to be terrible against against Odog. Oh, okay, it wasn't that bad. All right, cool. The Tailwind petered out. I guess I'll bring him in. I guess. I'll have Odog try to heal him, maybe. Um, I need to pull off a Discharge. And then have Odog just try to heal him really quick with a... Uh, I think a max potion. Let's see what we got. 
I need to slow down these two. That's not a big deal. I was expecting O-Dog to, to just die. So, <laughs> there we go. Um, moon Blast. No, 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 no. I don't know even know what to do. Moon Blast is terrible. Just charge. <laughs> All right, cool. Super effective against both of you. She's paralyzed, which is great. Uh, he's not, but he ate something. Whatever, dude. Okay. Um, oh my gosh, so many are just dead. Hey, dog, get out of here. You're gonna have to just be, we're gonna have to just revive. Every time I think I'm prepared for these battles, something goes wrong. In my bag, we have a revive that we're gonna use on him. In my bag, we have a revive that we're going to use on, actually, let me use a full restore on you. There you go. So one revive, one full restore. Hope I don't get blasted with both things at E-Dog, because E-Dog needs to be able to attack these two. I mean, he's electricity. He's here now. Dang, that sucks so bad. All right. Dang it, really? Ugh. All right, well, let's bring out Raichu. We need to revive. In my bag, there is a revive that we're going to use once more on you. I hate this quick draw thing. All right, E-Dog's back in the business. Uh, I was expecting something like that against A-Dog. A-Dog is just a bullet sponge right now. Good, she's gone. <sighs> All right. Al Krimi. Aww. Uh, Al Krimi is what? Oh, it's just a fairy. Okay, great. We can bring back. Uh, there we go. And then uh, in my bag, there is a revive that we're going to use on T Dog. All right, here we go. Let's hope we get this Thunder Punch off. Oh, Iron Tail. That was good. Could be better. Alluring voice, ouch. Okay, he's gone. A-Dog survives another day. Um... We're gonna bring in E-Dog. I'm gonna do a flash cannon at her. And in my back, I'm just gonna do a hyper potion. No, max potion. There you go. I think the biggest problem is I'm not really using any like good synergies. <laughs> I haven't learned that yet. Yeah, yeah, okay, targeting him. That's expected, honestly. I'm glad he's taking that. Oh, not recover. Come on, you can't just do that. How much do you recover? Most of it. Ah, it's super effective, but going nowhere. Jiminy. All right. Come on, let's go, let's go. Uh, let's do it again. In my bag, we have a max potion that we're going to use on you. For if you have to come back, you'll be full and ready to go. All right, whatever, let's go. Flash cannon, good. He's taking the brunt of that again. He's still in it. He, I can't believe he's still in it. Oh, he's poisoned. He's going to die. <laughs> All right. Whatever. Let's go. Let's go. Unless I get a potion chance, I'll, I can just use a potion on him again. 
Nope, he's gone. He has to be gone. Yep. Okay. Here we go. Bringing out T Dog. Let's do it. Flash cannon on Alchemy. Dude, I don't know. I'll do the Gigaton hammer on you. I don't even know, man. Ah, oh, he's still alive! Alchemy's using recru- Oh my gosh. Killing me, Alchemy. Should have used it on her. Flamethrower is not gonna feel good. Okay, sure. Okay. Alright, alright. Here's what we're gonna do. E Dog is gonna heal himself with a full restore, and then I'm going to battle Alchemy with the flash with Slowbro with the flashing. There we go. Get rid of him. Hopefully, maybe, maybe not. Let's do it. E Dog's back in the biz. No. Okay, I'm still alive somehow. Here comes Flash Cannon. He's gone, thankfully. How many more does she have left? Because we can still bring in Lucario and do the Terrestrialize. Who's she gonna send out next? Man, that thing is just fully recovered again. Wow, okay. Okay, Excadrill. Is it, how many more does she have? Oh, these are the last two. So extra drill might be who she's going to. Uh, extra drill. Wait, what? Extra drill is a ground steel. I'm really confused. Here, I'm gonna go ahead and fully restore. I'm so confused. Let's do Gigaton Hammer against Alchemy. I'm so confused about. Is he gonna X? Is he wait? Is he gonna terrestrialize as a, as a fairy? All eyes in our great big terrestrial heart. Time to get even cuter and cuter. I guess he is gonna do that. Is it fairy type? Yeah, it is. Okay. Cute. <laughs> All right. Then let's uh, high horsepower. Dang it! All right. We're gonna bring in Lucario. Decorate. What the heck is decorate? What the heck is that? Great. Um. Come on. All right, gonna bring in Lucario. This is so risky. Um, going to in my bag. I'm going to go ahead. Wait, what? What am I doing? In my bag, and use a revive on T Dog. Everyone's dead again. For Lucario, I'm gonna battle. I'm gonna terrestrialize and use. Which one's worse? Bullet punch. Oh yeah, this one. A steel move against Excadrill. Please let me go first. <laughs> Please let me go first. Here we go. Maybe. There you go. No! Son of a why? I miss what is high horsepower? I hate this. Dude, what the heck? Why is this happening to me? This is terrible. I am losing this. 
I do not like this. The special attack rising like that. I guess we're bringing this out. Sure, swap in. Um, I guess I'll need to revive someone else. Actually, let me just try to do uh, a full restore to you. Can you just get this Gigaton Hammer out right now? Can you just do it now? Can I go first, please? No! Oh my god. I hate this so much. This is not good. Um, I need... This sucks. Uh, I need to revive... I literally don't even know who to revive. You, I guess. All right, back in the biz. Get him, Exodrilla. Send them flying with your adorable destructive force. Terra Blast. I don't know about this. Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. <laughs> Absolutely ridiculous. Alluring voice. Great. Great. Okay, that wasn't good. Good, good. In my bag, we can revive. I'm almost out of revives. This is absolutely terrible. No, not him. Oh, shoot. Okay, well, Lucario's coming back. Yeah, high horsepower destroys me. This is like the worst. <laughs> this is the absolute worst. Giga Drain on who? We're all gone. I cannot believe this fight. This fight is awful. Every time I think I'm prepared for a fight, like I'm looking up, like, oh, it's fairy type. I'm gonna bring these guys in. Bag, I, I need it more max. I'm almost out of revives, dude. Are there any other things that are like revives? Like, are there any just other things that I can use? No. All right. Uh, revive. This is, I'm just gonna keep reviving people. See how it goes. Sure, yeah, that's expected. Um, yep, okay. And then uh, in my bag, revive who? I don't know. What, they're fairy, poison, steel, that's it. All right. I just, I can't, I don't know what to do with this like constant I'm gonna be out of revives very soon. I just gotta get, I just gotta have them stop attacking me every single time. But they keep attacking me with high horsepower, it's awful. I don't get to move, I, I can't even move. I have to just, I just keep shuffling these revives. They're not giving me a breather, which I get, I wanna give them a breather either. See the high, why? High horsepower every single time. Is there any way to block that? I don't know. Okay, I'm seriously almost out of revives here. Is it gonna be another high horsepower? Yeah, it's another high horsepower. Oh, thank, how do I avoid the attack? I don't even know. He could drain those, gonna hit me. Not very effective, that's fine. All right, bring out this, and if I can, I mean, I might die here. Okay. 
You need to revive someone else. I don't even know who. How about you? And then you need to try to battle with this Gigaton Hammer. If you can just hit him with it, please let me go first. Stop! Why, why not the other one? All right. All right. Yep, surprise. All right, Raichu's gonna do the reviving then. I'm gonna try to hit him with uh, Discharge. And then Raichu is going to revive. I have three left. I cannot get a hit off of this, but sure, here we go. If I could like stun some of these guys, there's high horsepower coming for who? Nobody, good. No! Are you joking, kidding me? They're always attacking the person who doesn't do an item. It's so ridiculous. All right, they can't attack both of us, can they? Maybe maybe that's the thing. Maybe they won't attack both of us. So I'm going to attack both of them right now. I'm running so low on revives. Gigaton Hammer coming your way. And uh, Iron Tail coming your way. Iron Head. What? Oh, he's paralyzed. Good, 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 good. Where's, where's my hammer? I need my hammer now. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Thank you, oh my gosh. Wow. I can't believe it works. Oh no, not, don't, don't kill me with that, thank you. Okay, okay, great. Now we're in a much better position. I can revive somebody. Uh, how about you, I guess? Who? I don't know who. Maybe you. Okay, great. Holy cow. Now I can't use Gigaton Hammer again. The Giga Drain doesn't do much. I, I want to heal. Full max potion. And then I'm going to do Iron Tail on you so that you'll be focused more on healing. And I almost lost this battle. I cannot believe how bad I'm doing at the battles. Even though I'm like really getting overpowered. How did you avoid my attack? Are you joking, kidding me right now? Wow, okay. Gigaton hammer. Oh, what, what do you mean twice in a row? I did a potion or something. In my bag, we have a full max potion again. Holy cow. I need to buy a ton more revives. I wish you could just buy max revives. What's with that? Flash cannon is not going to be a miracle, but... Good. Now work on healing yourself if you can or whatever. Yeah, yeah. All right, here comes the Gigaton Hammer. I think she's done for, finally. And we didn't even get to use Lucario's thing. I'm gonna revive him anyway, just so that he can maybe gleam a little XP from this move. Oh man, goodbye. Gigaton Hammer was great, I'm glad T-Dog was back. That fight was awful. I almost blew it completely. How am I doing so bad sometimes? I hate losing, but I love seeing such cute Pokemon. Yeah, there you go. All right, well, well, well. Z-Dog, Z-Dog, did you see? Did you see our Pokemon battling it out? Oh, it's almost too much. They were just too cute, even for me. You're the cutest lazy. <laughs> nope, wrong. We're not talking about me. We're talking about my Pokemon. <laughs> 
Your Pokemon were very cute as well, Z Dog. Phew, you know, it's just not right for two people to hang all this cuteness between them. Why don't we wrangle up the cute Pokemon here for a cute picture we can share with everyone? <laughs> nope, wrong. <laughs> all right. Well, there we go. Oh, this one's just too cute. I'm going to make myself a backup copy or three. It's on a phone. I mean, I'll give you this as well as proof of your cuteness. Alluring voice. Great. Well, next up is fighting a dragon type. I don't know how that's going to go. You really are very strong when you get serious in battle, Z-Dog. I wonder how far you'll be able to get facing off against the strongest trainers in our school. I'll keep an eye out uh, for you and your progress. Oh, wow. Okay. That was something. A little too much of something. I will see you guys... Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, this guy. Yo, yo, yo. Champ in the making. That's three of the Elite Four. You trounce now. Seeing how far you're getting is making me sweat a little. Lacey's all about cuteness, and that's what helps her make her Pokemon stronger. She's into her team. She's so into her team. Training the little cuties doesn't even feel like work for her. Wild, huh? I bet it's the same for you, huh? You work so hard, and it's all because you like it. Unlike a certain someone who seems busy ru running himself and everyone around him into the ground just to get a bit stronger. You know, Lacey's polite to everyone else, but she's really blunt with me. I wonder why. You know, bud, seeing skills like yours up close and personal really leaves an impression. No wonder I it had such an effect on Kieran. But enough about that. I guess your elite fourth match is going to be against me. Nice of you to save the best for last. You gave me plenty of time to get ready. See you soon. Show us what you got. I'm scared. I'm scared of it, honestly. This is not going to go well. If that fight, I, I, I'm barely hanging on by a thread, even though I feel like I really prepared. Like, I brought, like, in special Pokemon that I wouldn't have otherwise brought. Anyway, thanks for watching. Come back next time for more. Goodbye. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help the channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join on YouTube and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop. Come back next time for more.